For the absolute value function, which is in the form of f of x equals absolute value of the x, by definition, it means for the value that x greater than or equal to 0, the absolute value of the x is the same as the x. For the value that x less than 0 or the negative x value, take the, take the absolute value, the negative sign will be disregarded. Then, when we look at the graph, it is in the V-shaped form. For the positive side or the side at x greater than or equal to zero, the absolute value of the x is the same as the x. On the left side, or when x is less than zero, you put the absolute value, for example, of the negative four, it turns out to be four. So then you're going to have like the decreasing line. Put them together, it is the V-shaped graph. The next type of the function is the greatest integer function. By definition, the greatest integer function of the x is the largest integer less than or equal to x. For example, the greatest integer function of 4.3, you have two numbers that 4.3 in between, 4.3 between the number 4 and number 5. So we take the one that less than or equal to x. So we're going to take 4. Similar to the negative 2.6, negative 2.6 is between two integers, which is negative 3 and negative 2. The lower one is the negative 3. So therefore, the greatest integer function of negative 2.6 is negative 3. And the graph looks at the steps. Sometimes we call the step function.